What's up, everybody? What's going on? How you doing? Welcome back to some dealer simulator. Where today we're going to be uh, 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 opening the store. That's what we're going to be doing. Hopefully, open the store, look at the auction if we ever get enough money to do the auction and and do something like that. Now, uh, at the end of the last stream, if you didn't see, um, we actually sold the box truck, so we don't own the box truck anymore. Instead, we sold it so that we could afford to buy the store now we have a red truck we're back to the small red truck and we're gonna live with that for now now i don't know if i have enough money at the start of this to uh to to to, to go at it with the with the store we gotta like buy shelves and stuff like that but that's all right because we could do jobs and and things like that but I, I i was told that once you start the store or once you open the store you cannot actually uh sell at the flea market anymore which is quite interesting uh, you know, I wonder why they kind of block you off from from selling at the at the flea market um, Now that you have bonus store anyways, that's how it is and um, we're gonna be jumping in, into this I hope you all are having a good Saturday. Happy Saturday to you all. Hello Barkley. Hello Maya J. Hello Anna Maria. Hello. Hello Hello mirror mirror 4 f2 p Yep gonna screw that one up uh, Hello to you <laughs> Hello, Dark Links. How are you? Susie T. Hello, Velvet Glove. How are you? Hello, Amanda Market. Hello, Alexander. How's it going? Welcome in. Hello, Steve. What's going on? Neko, how are you doing, Neko? Doubling games. Welcome in. Tulip, hello, Tulip. Papa Furby, how are you, Papa Furby? Welcome in. Arnica, hello, Arnica. Dogmeat, hello, Dogmeat. Welcome in. Help I Gaming, Alexander Eastman, how are you? Lorinda, 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 Lorinda Crosby, how are you? Welcome in. Good to see you. Alexis D2J. Hello. Hello. Welcome in. Keisha. How are you, Keisha? Good to see you. Dark Dragon. How are you, Dark Dragon? First time in a live. Well, welcome into a live. Good to see you. Envy. Hello, Envy. Hello, Shantae. Hello, Summer Sunshine. Welcome in. Uh, you had, you had, Keisha, I had, I had was thinking that in maybe easier to transport all the stuff from lockers by not opening the boxes. That way you could stack them and then have them all a mess of the little stuff. That's actually a great idea. Yes, I, I might do that today, actually. Just take the boxes to the store, right? Because there's a recycler at the store anyways. Aaron and Pink. Hello, Aaron and Pink. Pink, how are you? Lady Fluffy Dragon, welcome in. Everybody lurking, smirking, and possibly working on this Saturday. Hello to you all. Hello, Malachi. Um, yeah, hello to you on YouTube and hello to you on Twitch. Welcome in. Good to see you. Yeah, so that's actually a fantastic idea. So let's go ahead and jump in. And, uh, and, and, and dive into this. Why did we not think about that before? <laughs> Why did we not think about that before? You just take the boxes, take the boxes to the store, right? Aaron and Pink, thank you for the two months. How are you? How are you doing? Thank you for the two months, Aaron and Pink, for the tier one sub on Twitch. Welcome. Hello, Ramon. How are you? Thank you for the two months, Aaron. Good to see you. You just finished uploading some of the gameplay before the stream. Uh, did you? Are you playing this game too? Yeah. Hello, Tammy. How are you, Tammy? Hello, Michael. How are you, Michael? Welcome in. All right, let's jump in. So, red truck. We'll do it. We have bills to pay. Go figure. Red truck. And then... Oh, yeah. Wait a sec. Somebody commented also. Uh, settings. Game volume. Hey, maybe when you set the game volume, maybe you should... I don't know hit hit apply you freaking idiot there you go hello megan t how's it going watch now that's like too loud isn't it <laughs> okay bring it back down bring it back down bring it back down i think 45 there we go okay all right now with the 1400 i think what i'm gonna do is i'm probably going to i should probably go to the store right away just so we can kind of get an idea of what we're going to be doing today but yeah i feel like i need to like no we're fine we're fine volume's good volume's good yeah mm -mm -mm -mm. so then what i'll probably do to save space is i will probably end up uh just putting boxes in this i think that road is new back there that is a ro new road i'll just end up you know Taking the boxes with us to the store. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, crazy magic. What's going on? How you doing? What's happening? And then the, as far as the house goes, I mean, I would like to buy a bed for the house today, too. 
at least give it a re well we're gonna have to buy what is it we're gonna have to buy a, a bed for the house yeah we have to mm oh god pay attention pay attention hello kick glass how's it going kick glass welcome in my lord <laughs> okay now i don't know how you get shelves i guess you would get it from the furniture store or do you actually can you order them through the uh through the computer i'm probably not right probably can't order them through the computer you probably have to go get the shelves from the furniture right hello tom actually you do because i if i remember correctly we've only been to the furniture store once i don't know why i did that Good thing we can drive through trees, though. But, yeah. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Furniture store. Okay, furniture store. So, let's see what we have here real quick. So, we have a recycler here, right? Yeah, we have a recycler. That's there. Great. Open. Open. And then, inside of the computer, we'll go ahead and pay our bills. $360. Because we have a store now. Oh, man. Uh, so there's like a search i guess what a research person is this with this search person i don't know i guess research and then repair person okay eventually we'll see about those we already have the name of the sh shop which doesn't show right there weirdly enough uh bank wise um you can accept a ten thousand dollar bank loan with a bank interest of twenty thousand dollars which is crazy. Now, the weekly payment, pay every 12 days. Is that... Wait, what? Wait. Is that bi-weekly? It's not even two weeks. Um, <laughs> I'm a little confused on that. 12 days. Payment every 12 days. $2,500. Now, okay, look. The interest is, is, is crazy, right? But it takes a very, very long time... To actually progress 12 days in this game so just think about that anyways let's hit the road let's make some money let's uh go to the furniture shop let's get it all in yeah mm -hmm. i can be your cashier you have a but you have 112 street currently going right now excuse me what mm -mm 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 -mm. um Let's go. We'll go oncoming traffic because, you know, I drive like an A to the hole in this game. And then we'll go do a couple of jobs on the way to the furniture shop. It's so far away, isn't it? It's like over that mountain. Should pay attention in front of me, shouldn't I? Hello, Bruce. How's it going, Bruce? How's it going? What's happening? Probably hit actually two jobs on the way there. How's our fuel? I like driving this better than the uh, box truck. I have to say whoa it is a little bit loosey-goosey but it's fine it gets the job done it does get the job done holy crap okay it gets the job done too good just stay put actually you know what you know what you know what you know what i'm not doing that one over there I'm not doing that job i should do that job f i should Ugh. Gosh, cut the grass. There we go. I should do it. I shouldn't skip out on it. I should do it. Yep. Especially when we need to buy furniture right now. Yep. All right. You're playing gas station simulator and you was asked if you would be my cashier. Oh, I see. I see. I see. I see. Yeah. Skirt. Yeah. Hello, Manda Panda. When watching the last Supermarket Sim, you said you were uh, you was a paper plate person and didn't like fine china. My husband and I call paper plates fine china. Well, then your you and your husband are my kind of people. So I'm glad that we are on that page. <laughs> All right, let's go. That is fine china, baby. I agree. Mm -hmm. The search guy is great to hire. He prices hey, your items on selling shelves. So he prices the items, then puts them on the shelf. Is that what you're saying? AJ, thanks for hey, subscribing. Subscriber. And Chris Simpson, thank you for subscribing as well. Hello, both of you. Welcome in. 
That is. That is fine China. Every time I say fine China, I think of like the song in my head. Melanie. Hello, Melanie. Thank you for three months. Resubscribing. Thank you for the prime sub for three months. I appreciate it, Melanie. How are you doing on this Saturday? Hope you're doing well, yeah? That's the three months. I think that's actually, I think you might be like the one of the, if not longest uh, tenured subscribers on Twitch right now, Melanie. So thank you. Appreciate that. Hello, bedtime. How's it going? Mm hmm. Paper plates are the best. With disposable fork. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -mm 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 -mm. You was watching Raptor playing Pacific Drive. I was too, actually. <laughs> this morning I was watching it. I was watching him play Pacific Drive. And you know what? It made me want to play Pacific Drive. <laughs> I'm having too much fun with that game. There we go. Mm -mm -mm. I'm having too much fun and I'm like, I'm slightly, maybe a little bit of addicted to that game. Possibly. Yeah. In supermarket simulator move your checkout to where your fridges are for a better flow of 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 traffic well i mean you do that and then when you expand the shop again then you're gonna have to readjust it again right because the expansion is gonna go on that wall anyways you were subscribed a while ago weren't you melanie yeah i think you might be the longest tenured <laughs> Yeah, I know his car is pimped out. I, yeah, and that's what it makes me want to play. Is like I want to like play again because I'm like, ah, oh, dude, I want to pimp my car out even more because we just got into like the customization last time we were playing too. I was like, oh, this is nice. Hello, Maggie Mae. How are you? Oh crap! Oh, I'll take the L on that. Excuse me. Hello, Samantha. How's it going? These vehicles look like it how it look like they drive on icy roads. Yeah, if you if you ever play this game and you touch the dirt, the dirt is literally like ice. And it's very much like ice. Oh god, this one handles kind of bad too. Alright, let's pull in. Let's get this money. Here we go. Let's do that. Get the truck. I think, I don't know. Can you only do two jobs a day? Is it two jobs a day? There we go. Becky rocks. She does rock, doesn't she? Even though, even though I got dinged yesterday by YouTube. YouTube said that yesterday's Pacific Drive video was an inappropriate video. So they demonetized me briefly yesterday. So that was cool. And then I had to like get the stream manually reviewed to let them know that it wasn't inappropriate. And this morning they turned it back on. So that's fun. <laughs> Gotta love that. How? I wish they would tell you. They don't tell you. It's all AI based. It's all automatic. They don't tell you and it's all AI. Oh, but a human reviewed it and they're like, oh yeah, this is fine. Merlin Mage. Merlin Mage, how are you? Thank you for the resubscription for the two months. Thank you for the two months, Merlin Mage on Twitch. Hello. Oh, you were subscribed a few years ago or a few years first, then saw you on Twitch before your most recent Twitch streams. Just long time follower. Oh, very good. Thank you, Melanie. Appreciate that. <laughs> Good afternoon to you, Tuscan, Tux, Cut, Tux, Tux, and Rob, Tux, Tusk and Rob, Tux, and Rob, Tusk and Rob, Tux, and Rob. How's it going? Yeah. There we are. So, yeah. That's why I put it in the Discord. I was like, sorry for the inappropriate stream yesterday for Pacific Drive. Which was very, like, sarcastic of me, but I don't know. That's what YouTube said. 
they said your stream is not suitable and is not appropriate for advertisers clean up your act i didn't do anything just playing a game and lord hello ida how are you ida every time i'm watching a video from you you go live oh <laughs> are you playing a game then <laughs> like all right maybe if i watch another video he'll go live again you know perfect okay let's get some shelves how much are shelves sir is this a shelf or is this furniture i need a bed too 400 dollars for a bed that's so cheap um We'll do that. Actually, hang on. Put that back. Cancel. Destroy? I would not want to destroy. I did not mean to do this. What does destroy mean? I just want to put it... Can I put it back in its box? Is that what destroy means? Shit. What does the word destroy mean? That means I lose it forever? What does destroy? Destroy puts it back into a box. Okay, thank God. They need to change that word. What do you mean destroy? Destroy. I was like, oh, I pull out the thing. Here's Thanos. Destroy? Okay. I don't know. Maybe like put back or box or dismantle or something, but destroy? Seems kind of heavy. <laughs> All right. We desperately need a bed. So let's get a bed. I just bought two beds because it didn't chick ching on me and I didn't think I bought the first time. <sighs> and I can't sell, can I? Probably can't. I can't pick this up with one either. Ah, Lord. It didn't chick ching on me, so I didn't know if I bought it or not. Lovely. Very lovely. Three box would be better. That's true. Hello, Dustin. How's it going? Once you place the shelf down, you can't move it from that spot on at all what you can't move it at all once you place something down you can't move it at all is that right are you kidding me mm, the streams are so late in your time zone you fall asleep an hour in the other night oh i see i see i see time zones time zones are getting you i feel you there we are one for the house and one for the shop <laughs> I would like to, I mean, I was trying to buy multiple tables, but I didn't mean to buy multiple beds. So that really sucks. And you can't, like, resell. All the YouTubers have been doing that with the beds? Okay, well, that makes me feel better. I guess I'm not the only one, then. Well, I, all right. On we go. Back to the, uh, back to the store. Hopefully this doesn't fly out or anything. Wait, look at it and press Z. What is this looking at it and pressing Z do? Oh, you must be talking about uh, reboxing. I see. There you go. Yes, you can. You just need to look at it at the right spot. What is the hitbox so small or something? Yeah, that's. <laughs> I can have a living, I can have a bedroom, or I can have a bed in my bedroom, or I can have a bed in my bedroom, and a bed in my living room. That's what I could do. Mm-hmm. Never saw the store yet. I don't know. Actually, you, there's two stores you can have in this game, huh? There's the big store, which I believe is, if I remember correctly, that's a new road, too. Let's take that road. Shit, don't lose your box, sir. Um, I think the big store is 35,000, I believe. Let's go this way. Mm -hmm. The hitbox is normally in the bottom left corner. Oh my god, that sounds awful. I lost my box! Where'd I lose it? Where'd I lose it? Where'd I lose it? Where I lose it.
If I was a box, where would I be? If I was a box, where would I be? Right there. <laughs> Scoot over! There we go. <laughs> hello, T. Hello, Gina. How are you? Welcome in, both of you. <sighs> hey, look, a free box where there's a giant bed inside. How did that bed fit in that box? I don't know. The magical box. I would like to at least try the auction today, but I don't know. Does Has anybody done the auction? If anybody's done the auction, how much money do you think we, we need to have for the auction? Uh, the patch notes say you need a lot of money. Now, what's considered a lot of money? I think $100 is a lot of money. <laughs> but some people perceive a lot of money in different ways. You know, I don't know. You need at least 10000 minimum? Damn. That's rough. That is pretty rough, isn't it? That's really rough. And take a loan out just to go to the auction. That'd be a terrible idea. <laughs> Hmm. Oh, oh. Vacuum packed furniture technologies these days, right? Mm hmm. Cost $600 to enter. The items can range from 2K to 10K. Okay. Skirt. Hello. All right, first table. Where should I put it? Uh, rotate. Wait, how do you rotate? Okay, that's how you rotate. That's the front. Okay, let's put first table right there. So let's test this out real quick. Okay, yeah, right there, remove. Okay, I see. Okay, so yeah, you can't like look at the table and press Z. You have to like look at the bottom of the table and press Z. Okay, understood. Uh, can you actually put a bed here? I guess technically you could, right? In the office? I mean, why not, right? You could do that. Probably. Holy hell. Oh, no, you can't place it in the area. Never mind. Oh, yeah, you can. <laughs> oh, right. I'm not going to do that, though. Um... No, we're not going to do that. Definitely not. And thank you, Gen Genzel, Genzel Perez. Thank you for the super chat. I really enjoy your videos. It's not much, but a small con contribution. I'm sorry I used the translator because I speak Spanish. Keep it up. Blessings. Hey, no problem. No problem there. And thank you for the generosity. And thank you for that. I appreciate you. I don't know why the notification didn't go off there yet. Stream Elements has been acting a little bit funky lately. OBS Stream Elements has been acting weird lately but uh, i appreciate you thank you for that thank you for the super chat and uh don't say sorry for your uh for your translation uh because you put it in the effort so thank you for that and i understand completely what you said and i glad you enjoy the videos and i gotta fix my chat hang on okay there we go okay lights on hello a pal How's it going, hey, pal? What's happening? Oh, wait, there's a job right there, sir. Madam, you, yes, us, together. Have I done that one yet? I don't think I have. Have I done this one? No, I don't think I have done this one. This is the fuel one. Let's do this. Let's do this job. So there's three jobs a day you can do. Got it. Let's go. Onward. That's what happens when you buy a double bed. You don't clip the wall. <coughs> My lord. They say hello to Game Station. Hello, Game Stations. Welcome in. Guess we can take a turn. This is a new road as well, I believe, too. Ah, my lord. Oh, this isn't good. Nailed it. Absolutely nailed it. 
kind of. The road system here is just terrible. <laughs> There's not a single street light or stop sign. Is there a stop sign in this game? <laughs> I don't even know. All right, delivering the fuel. Let's go. You know, what's one thing I do appreciate is that I do like the fact that um, when you do your job, you get teleported back to, you know, back to the office, which good thing you don't have to go back and forth, back and forth, you know. Hello, Super CVB. How's it going? There's no bangs in this game. I'm, are you referring to a space bar bang? What kind of bang are you talking about? Context. Let me dive this right on in. Hello. I'm here. Perfect. 750. Okay. Okie dokie. Back to where we were going. We were going home right now to put our beds up. Let's go. Coming out. Not a radio in this game either, huh? I ignore stop signs anyways. That's true. I do ignore them. <laughs> no stop sign can stop me. How dare thee. This is our little neighborhood that we're living in. What do you think our neighbors think of us? Oh, creating... Oh, <laughs> flipping the gas station would have created a big bang. I see what you mean there. <laughs> I left the front door open. What the hell's wrong with me? I'm asking to get robbed. Yeah, come on in. Rob my place. Even though I don't have nothing in here. All right. Okay, bedroom door. All right. Um, I left the front door just wide open. Centered. Okay. And then as far as this other bed, I mean, I don't know. I guess it could be for like for someone to uh, guest sleepover. Hooray. <laughs> Anybody that wants to come over and take a snooze, you can sleep in you can sleep in the living room, brother or sister. There you are. Cause this goes to garage. They can sleep in the garage. <laughs> this goes to outside. Oh, and the bathroom is in the back. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Alright. Watch, I'm gonna be ending up using this bed the whole time because it's closer to the front door. That's what's gonna happen here. Yeah. Uh, there goes the neighborhood. <laughs> Wait, I, I, I shut the back door, dude. There you go. Hello, Sea Fence. How's it going? Beds are now the new sofa. Okay, $1,400. Okay. All right. I see where we're at now, right now. What I'm going to do... I'm gonna drive this way. <laughs> I'm gonna do a job. I'll probably stop at the warehouse after the job. Um, see if there's a cheap warehouse I can buy, storage unit, whatever you wanna call it. If there's a cheap one, I'll buy it. If there's not a cheap one, I'll skip on it and I'll go and buy more furniture from the furniture store. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Slide all right on in, in here. Excuse me, part of me coming through. Whip that baby right now. Look at that. That's how you park. Look three times to do that. Okay, let's go. Oh, dude. Look at this. I've never done this before. Oh, this is cool. Dude, this thing goes so fast. <laughs> Holy crap, dude. Look at this thing. This thing's hauling ass. It's probably going as fast as the car that's on the damn uh, back. Hansel Perez became a member. Hansel Perez. Thank you very much for the uh, membership. Hello. Thank you for the membership. Take a load off. No one. Uh, no. Uh, no less either. Thank you for that. Hansel. 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 Appreciate you. Hello. 
How did that notification go off but the other one didn't? See, told you they're broken. Uh, thank you very much. I appreciate you. Dude, this thing is so fast. Look how fast this thing is. This thing shouldn't be going that fast. This is crazy, man. I mean, we're, we're, we're carrying like a two-ton car in the back. Possibly. Oh, wow. Wow. Hello, Soul Empress. How's it going? Okay. Let's just drop this car off at the furniture store. It is. We're dropping a car off at the furniture store. The hell's the deal here? It's like the best controlling, fastest vehicle we've ever driven in this game. Thank you. That was only $340. Oh, that sucks. Someone must have turned the limiter off. <laughs> <laughs> okay so real quick i'm gonna go to the storage unit place i'm gonna see how much there is if there's like an 800 dollar uh unit i'll buy it if there's not i won't and then i'll just go to the furniture store and buy more shelving instead yeah Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Okay, let's see. Eight hundred dollars. Okay. No. So I'm not gonna buy. I'm gonna go to the furniture store. We're gonna do another job on the way to the furniture store. <clears throat> and we should have enough money to buy maybe two or three different types of um shelving for the store. Uh oh. Something's happening. Oh wait, no, no, all right, never mind. I thought I couldn't shift again. I almost freaked out a bit. But we're all right. We're good. We're fine. Hey Jefferson, where's Becky? Wrong game. Becky is on the west coast in the redwoods. That's where Becky's at. Mm -mm -mm. When you hold down X, your character leans to the right. Wait, what? Really? In this game? Where's the box truck? I sold it so I could buy the store. Because that thing was expensive. And it was a headache because I couldn't get it out of first gear. Hello, Terry. How's it going, Terry? How are you doing? Ho, oh, he, hi, ho. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, what the hell? Excuse you. Mmm. -hmm. Da, 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 da. Stop. Okay, let's go. 750. So this will put us up to about 8... Uh, 28? No, wait. 50, 20, 2,500, sorry. This will put us at 2,500. For the uh, furniture store. That's nice. I love it. <clears throat> thoughts on drug dealer sim 2 i mean I, I don't know how i can have thoughts on it if that is something i've never played but my thoughts on it is it's coming out soon yes <laughs> hello ember how's it going how are you Uh, 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 mm. This game is strange when you hit another car, it disappears. I know, right? As soon as you, like, touch a car, a car, like, as soon as you touch a car, they just despawn. They don't, like, I guess it, like, makes it so that the, um, traffic doesn't kind of clog up or anything like that. 
Yeah, there's no damage for the truck. If there was damage in this game, I probably would drive less like an a-hole. But since I don't have any consequences, that is what it is. You've played the demo some and watch others. Quite, it's quite different from the first one. Is it? I haven't really paid attention to it. There we go. Like, is it different because it has a story or I don't know what kind of different, like different because it's less hardcore, maybe? Maybe it's less hardcore. Um, furniture. 2,500. Furniture shot. It looks like a Far, far Cry game now. It's a new engine. Maybe what... Maybe, maybe they wanted to go a different direction and make it less hardcore because... The first game was really hardcore. <laughs> And it was like impossible to cover that game without uh, being struck down by YouTube. There we go. No beds. <clears throat> Hello, Saul. How are you, Saul? Mm -hmm. Kind of want the big one. I do want the big one. Give me the big one. I want that one too. Okay. Good stuff. Mm-hmm. Have you ever played Watch Dogs? I played it when it first came out. Um I was the I was the person that watched God man, when there was like gaming conventions back then, they dropped the announcement for Watch Dogs. And we were so pumped. We were like, oh my god, this is going to be such an awesome game. And then it was like the biggest letdown of all time. Um, so yeah, I've played Watch Dogs. <laughs> it got better over time, but like when the game first launched, it was just awful because everything they promised. It's like No Man's Sky, right? Like No Man's Sky. When that game first launched, it was an absolute scam. An absolute just terrible nonsense. The, de the developers like promised so much and failed everybody but then you know over time it got better and better and better and better and now no man's sky a lot of people enjoy it because it finally has the features that they promised way in the beginning dun, 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 dun. whoa 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 cowboy you touch a little bit of the dirt and you go crazy calm down now <clears throat> First gaming shop convention I ever went to back then all the games was still on floppy disks <laughs> Go right here oh. There we go You can buy floor selling spots as well. Oh, you can Did I not see that there? So like if you wanted to put a chair or something Same with cyberpunk. I mean look the thing with cyberpunk is cyberpunk it had the features there the problem was it was just a buggy mess and the problem was is that where they were running cyberpunk on old uh generation hardware which was a bad idea but when i played cyberpunk i played on pc i didn't play it on consoles or anything like that i never had a problem uh like bugs or anything like that The first computer game I bought was on a cassette tape. Wait, what? A cassette tape? You talking floppy disk? Floppy disk, cassette tape. Mm hmm. Excuse me, get out of the way. TRS-80 was on a cassette tape? Wait, what? What the hell did those look like? A cassette tape? Interesting. Pop it right there. There we go. 
Hello, Darren. Thank you for the super chat. How's it going? I'm glad to be catching a live with my favorite channel community. Blessings be upon all today. How are you? And I hope your day is going well as well. Thank you for the super chat. Appreciate that. How are you doing? I apologize. The notifications are just not working today. But thank you very much. Thank you. Cassettes were before floppies? Oh my god. That just sounds awful. This game doesn't have a grid, right? There we go. Okay. So we have a quite a bit of uh, spots where we can like play stuff. All right. Slam that thing. There we go. Whoops. <clears throat> Cassette are better than punching card programming. We had a Commodore 64 too. And a bunch of tapes we didn't know what was on. Always fun to discover new games. <laughs> Dude, this is like crazy to hear. Cassette tapes. Cassette tapes. I'm just like thinking like a uh, like a like a like a brick, right? Like a brick. And for some reason, I'm just thinking like and I know this is not how it is, but you know like VHS, right? In VHS you rent a movie from Blockbuster. They charge you a rewind fee. I'm thinking in my head, like, if you beat the game, do you have to rewind the game? <laughs> that would be kind of funny now, wouldn't it? All right, we're going to cut the day early so we can uh, get some more money and then buy some warehouses. <laughs> the biggest scam of all time, the rewind fee. I'm sorry, am I stuck in the sleep here? Please don't tell me I, I'm stuck. Please be gentle. Please. <clears throat> Hopefully there was an auto save. Ah, oh, great. Now the game launches in window mode. What the hell happened? Be with you in a second. I don't know why it launched in window mode now. It doesn't say it's in window mode. There we go. All right. We'll see where the autosave was. Dude, I use Gamefly. I did. Did anybody else use Gamefly? I used it for like three months. Is that, th is that still a thing? Is that still a thing? Wait, 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 wait. I think this is like right exactly where we uh, crashed. Can you not sleep during the day or something? Is it like a bug? Oh no, there we go. Okay. All right, it's the next morning. <clears throat> I use Gamefly. It's like during the during the time where like Netflix, you know, Netflix was like, oh, we'll send you a movie in the mail. Well, like Gamefly, I'll send you a game in the mail, right? I don't know if they're still around or not. They still do the how the hell do they how are they, how the hell are they in business it was always fun getting a game in the mail right 
I think that was the best part of it. <clears throat> Gamefly is still up and running. <laughs> GameStop can't even like stay in business. How the hell is Gamefly still in business? What in the world? I'm literally hitting everything I see today and I... Maybe because they don't have like an overhead of like a bunch of like, you know, overhead of stores. They could just stay exclusively online, probably have a giant warehouse somewhere. And it's very like low cost compared to like a GameStop, I guess. Because like if you it's like if you you rent the game from Gamefly, if you like it, you keep it, you buy it. Yeah. It's probably a lot of like less overhead they have to deal with. I owe cans a lot for just Dinkum alone. Did I introduce you to Dinkum? GameStop tried to give me 60 bucks for his for the PS5. <laughs> I would have kicked that guy in the dick. <laughs> $60 for a PS5. Look here. $65, $60 for a PS5. Game rentals really changed. A game dev when it first came out because you had to worry about only renting and never buying if it was a short game. It's like the games that used to come out or like there was a demo in the game. The problem nowadays is like some demos that are coming out are so, so bare bo bones that I feel like there's some devs out there and look everybody you know learns lessons different ways but there's some indie devs out there that are like releasing demos that are so bare bones that i feel like it's tarnishing their reputation a bit oh crap there we go uh one of those games i actually did for like a first look at called a game called restaurant builder I recorded a video of Restaurant Builder and by the end of the video, I was like, this is absolute garbage. And so I just deleted the video and it was so bad hey, subscriber that I was not going to like show it off to the uh, show it off on YouTube because I thought it would have been a bad idea because I was like, this is this is definitely not a good idea. This is not good for the dev and I don't want to be the one to be like, like, I, like I'm not like. I want to give the dev a chance, not like diminish the game through a demo, you know, by the way, thank you Optimus Gaming for subscribing. Hello. How are you? And don't get me wrong. There's been games I've played on the channel that are absolute, absolute terrible. But when it comes to a demo, I'm like, yo, that's, uh, yeah, that's, that's not, uh, that's not <laughs> restaurant builder demo. If you. I think if it's still up on Steam, you might be able to like play the restaurant builder demo. I mean, you could play it for yourself, but that is bare bones. Holy hell. Nailed it. Anyways. <clears throat> oh yeah, mobile store sim. That was, that game was abandoned and broken too. Lots of indie devs don't really know about marketing. Yeah, and you know, and that's, it's a good point to make because even us content creators, like, there's so many different jobs that we're trying to learn all at the same time, right? Whether we are trying to be a commentator, trying to be an entertainer, trying to be a broadcaster, trying to be a marketer, try to have marketing abilities, try to uh, be an editor, try to be a researcher, right? Even for like indie devs who don't have mass amounts of budgets, um... They have to figure that out too. And some indie devs are really good. They'll email me and they'll be like, hey, this is a game. I think you would be interested in it. I think you and your audience will be interested in it. Here's our game. Here's a link to it. If you are interested, let us know. Or here's a key. Sometimes they just give you a key. You know, they don't wait for a reply. 
and some indie devs literally just send a subject in the email saying my game or whatever the name of the game is and then they'll send like two sentences saying hey i have a game will you please check take a look at it and the problem is is that when they do that they don't even leave a link to their game they don't leave a gift they don't leave screenshots they don't leave videos of their game and it's like okay <laughs> But yeah, some, 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 we all, we all need a little help. We all need a little help from time to time. Hello, Succubus. How are you? Good to see you. Welcome in. Bound, bound. But they didn't leave a sexy pick. They did not. They did not. But I don't judge them based off of their emails. Because there's been times where I've gotten incredible emails where it's like, oh, the most information of all time comes with a press kit, comes with this and comes with that. And like, okay, but the game never like fit for the channel, even though they said it, they did. And then like, sometimes i'll get an email that has bare bones and i'll be like okay <clears throat> let's talk more about this and then it happens to be like a fantastic game or like a really good game for the channel so to speak right so yeah <clears throat> hello baby girl how's it going keep getting it in right on right way keep getting in right side on pacific drive as i'm from the uk be good if you could change the side of the steering wheel <laughs> well i mean it is set in the united states set in washington i believe you're gonna really hate when Ta taxi life simulator comes out because i believe that's set in barcelona and they drive on this side of the this side of the road i think and this side of the of the uh vehicle as well like left side i guess sit in the left side let's see if we can get our uh uh warehouse now <clears throat> they need a uk mod for pacific drive <laughs> anytime i have to drive on that side of the car i just think like i'm driving as a postman or something Hello, Ashley. How's it going? Nailed the pedal to the floor just before the crash. <laughs> when you first started out, did uh, when you first started, did you out to the devs for games? Um, it depend. Yeah, it depended. Uh, it depended. Actually, when I first started out, uh, <laughs> like any other business, you're kind of like in debt in a way right so most of the time i was why are these don't say bye um i was buying games constantly uh so i never got keys because of the size of the channel so it, it's funny how like once you and this goes like not just with content creation but this goes like with just life in itself once you start to like get a hint of success or you start becoming this and that and that and this you start to get stuff for free you know what i mean and so when i started out i obviously didn't get stuff for free and i had to like buy every single game to cover so all the games i covered i was buying straight up oh yeah hey there's rc car should we do another one let's do it again watch this in case nobody have seen this yet take a look at this Spend money to make money. That's right. Look at this. How cool is this? I love this thing. I love this new feature that they have here. Being able to like drive a little RC car. <laughs> so funny. Hey Freya, how are you? <laughs> I wonder what the late. I wonder what the. Oh God. I wonder what the range limitation is. <laughs> Box it up. Whoops. Box it up. Nice. So cool. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
the people who get the most success and hey, can afford to pay for stuff end up getting their merch for free. I ended up getting everything for free, which is kind of interesting, isn't it? Marching band videos. Thanks for subscribing. I appreciate that. But you know, I guess that's the, that kind of goes back to the whole like marketing thing, right? The power of marketing. If you can market something fairly well, there's a good chance you're going to get it for free, right? There we are. Now, I'm not going to open up these boxes. I might... I don't know how the hell I'm going to do this, but... See, okay, maybe I might open up these boxes because there might be smaller items here. Box truck probably be best for this. Yeah, huh? Box truck. So, I'm going to open up these boxes here. See if I can break them down. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's true. Yeah, it's... I mean, that's very true. Like, members of the channel back in... Like, over the last, like, two or three years, members of the channel helping me... Uh, people who used to, uh, what would they, like, a lot of people would used to, like, gift, uh, Steam gift card. They would send me gift cards through Steam and stuff. That really helped, uh, get new game releases and stuff like that to cover new games. Um, you know, I know some people are like, well, I don't want to, like, some, you know, some people are like, I don't want to donate money because I don't know what you're going to do with the money, right? Or some people are like, you, you know how people get, right, sometimes, but... Uh, well, the good thing about like the Steam gift card is that at least people knew that that those gift cards most likely, um, most likely, well, actually, they were back then. They definitely were going straight towards uh, new game releases and stuff like that. So that was like a best way to be like, okay, I know where this money is going to is going to be coming to new games when it comes to the channel. That's kind of how it was. Um, I, I hate to say back then because I I don't feel like it's a back then scenario because I I think it's more or less I'm just kind of like I don't believe it if that makes any sense like I don't believe you know there's all you guys are all watching me I don't believe that there's this many people watching me on YouTube and there's this many people watching me on Twitch there's this many people watching me on a daily basis there's this many people subscribed to the channel. I don't believe that stuff because it doesn't feel real to me yet. And I don't know why. I'm, I am still feel like I'm back in like 2021. <laughs> and it's, a, it's one of those things, man. I don't know. It's hard to like... It's hard to fathom, I guess. I'm still having trouble with it. I'm still having trouble with it. There you go. I think it's more or less because it's like it's something I've always wanted to do but I always thought that it was like impossible to do and so I never thought I could actually do it and then you do it and you're like no I can't believe that <laughs> I think that's wrong I think I think this is a bit I think everybody is pranking me I think Ashton Kutcher is going to come out and kick me in the dick as well I think this is all just jokes man that's what I think maybe that's how I feel <laughs> it's a figment of our it's a, we are a figment of your imagination exactly yeah can I play can you play this game on a basic computer I don't know what the specs are for this game but I can't imagine it's too high so uh, I would say maybe yeah mm-hmm I understand that feeling. The sense of my promotion last year, I have moments where I don't believe I am in the place I am. Imposter syndrome sucks. Is that what it's called? Is that what it's called? Imposter syndrome? I don't know what that means. You take that kick? Well, thank you for giving me that offer. <laughs> <laughs> It might come back to like the whole like dinkum craze. It's probably that. It's probably the dinkum craze that I'm like, wait a sec. How do I know all these people? Do you actually have? Can you put? Okay, you could put anything on here then. Okay, so you could go like 95. And people come in right now. Yeah, I guess so. Okay, this is broken, which we're gonna have to get a repair guy. So we'll wait on that here in a sec. 
Uh, we'll at least sell a little bit of stuff. Yeah, we can do that. <laughs> okay, there, 70. Sell some shoes. Sell a DVD. There we are. We open now. Okay, open. Okay, this is broke. Oh, hello. Wow, that was fast. They're like waiting on me. Hello? Where do you go? What are you doing? Okay, you went to the counter. Shoe 120. Sell. Perfect. That's our first item sold. All right, that worked like a charm. Now, didn't it? RC car. Oh, shit. There we go. Perfect. <clears throat> Can you put multiple items on the same table? Um, for hey, the same subscribe. price. I don't think so. I don't think that's how that works. I think you might actually ac accidentally lose uh, out on something. You might actually ac accidentally sell something for less when you really meant to sell it for more. Thank you, Tyson, for subscribing. Hello. Also, I was told that if you hit the subscribe button, I think fireworks go off or something on the button. I don't know. Is that true? There we go. 75. I know if you hit the like button, you get a pretty animation. $15 scooter. You know how many times I killed my ankles with the these freaking scooters, man? Uh, bargain you 75 not 750 75 okay then you can leave imposter syndrome is when you earn your success under false pretenses and at any time people will find out and you will collapse okay that sounds actually kind of intense there you go RC car for you uh, 70. Thank you. <laughs> Come on now. God, we have so many broken parts. I think we'll be able to afford the repair guy, though. I think so. I don't think he's too much. There we go. 95, 95. Sold. How much is he again? 459? At least this guy is. Buy the worker. I like how it says buy worker. <laughs> so wait, okay. What do we do? Do we just drop it in front of him? Or does he go get this stuff? How does this work? Where did he go? He disappeared? I don't know where he went. Did he quit? Did he quit already? Where did he go? Where, where did he go? What happened to him? What happened to him? I don't know what happened. Get the repair guy. Use scrap repair option for free repair. Wait a sec. He does, does he stay here? Yeah? Do not buy the worker to waste some money. Wait for big store or you need to, or you need to after auction. I, what do you, I can't wait until, well, I can't wait till big store. That's $35,000 away, isn't it? I can't wait for a big store. What am I going to do with all these broken items? That's absurd. Union break. Repair guy leaves at 5 p.m. Okay, thank God. That was the most useful piece of information I got got today. So he leaves at 5. Is that right? He just clocked out is all right. Okay. So he'll be back in the morning, yeah? You 
can have the fixer, just not the one for pricing. Oh, no, I'll do the pricing. Okay. All right. Let's put the scooter up here. 15. That's a cheap ass scooter. Those things go for like 80 bucks. All right. Have we seen the auction? I, I have not. No, I've not seen the auction yet. Hopefully we will today. Yeah. That's my hope. You use the repair guy at the marketplace. Can you still use him at the marketplace then? Yeah. You just can't sell there. Repair guy clocked in, saw you actually expected him to work, then qu and then quit. <laughs> Hello, boss. Oh, you expect me to work? Oh, clock out. <laughs> Hello, Teresa. How are you, Teresa? You woke up at 4 a.m. to watch a wrestling pay-per-view. Which one was that? Use the repairer at night. The repair guy at night. I really want to see how this guy works. That's how I want to see. Is he like, uh, he's X amount of money per day, right? It's like $50 a day, $70 a day, $60 a day. Holy sh- Oh, Jesus. All right. Yep. Okay. That worked out. Hello, Suzy Q. How are you, Suzy Q? What's happening? Did I leave the front door open again? The hell's wrong with me? Please, not again. Not again. No, not again. Exactly. Were you born in a barn? Hmm. You pay him once every five days. Okay. Well, I guess we broke the game again. Let me relaunch it. Should I sleep in the bed in the bedroom? <laughs> Maybe that bed is broken. <laughs> WWE estimation chamber in Australia. In Australia. At Australia. Okay. Let's try again. Hello, Amanda. How are you? Okay. Oh, shit. All right. Sleep. We'll use the other bed. What is happening? Why can I not sleep in the game? Hey! Somebody's gonna get hurt. Listen here. All right, let me close the game. <clears throat> Is there an update to this game? Is there a hotfix that I'm not seeing here? Did this game get updated today? Hang on, let me see. <sighs> let's see, let's see. What's the state? What's the status of this game? Was there an update recently? No, just February 20th. Okay. All right. Okay. Run it back again. Gotta go back to the trailer where you belong. <laughs> can't, can't afford to sleep, so keep working. Let's try to load it instead of continue it.
This is a problem. This is a this is a problem. This is a problem. We'll try the trailer. We'll try the trailer. This is a big problem. If we cannot advance to the next day. <laughs> having two gate having two beds is bugging the game, you think? Should I should I try to get rid of the, the other bed? I do that. We got two. We got two. <clears throat> two ways. We'll get rid of the bed. One of the beds. That doesn't work, then we'll try the trailer. Come here. <gasps> there we go. Okay. Put this in the garage. Okay. Here we go. There you go. There you go. All right. F that bed. Let's go. <laughs> am I planning on playing Power World? I am not. All right. Very good. Maybe the bed was made out of rocks. Bed rock. Wait, Flintstones. Meet the Flintstones. Have a yabba dabba doo da day. Hey. Look, the live action Flintstones was actually pretty cool. You know, with John Goodman. There's a Rosie O'Donnell in there, too. That live action Flintstones was pretty good. Yeah, I thoroughly enjoyed the movie. I have to admit. Didn't they make like a re I feel like they made like a some sort of remake of the Flintstones recently too like a live-action remake A live-action Flintstones gave you nightmares what kind of nightmares were you having? What in the world? Did you have a nightmare that your bed turned into a rock? Or that you had to drive with your feet? <laughs> What kind of nightmares were you having? <laughs> Hello, JK. How's it going? There's a prequel. Oh, there, there was like multiple, right? There's like multiple. It's like the Scooby-Doo live action movies. Like there's like the Scooby-Doo live action. And then they like years later made more Scooby-Doo live actions. It's like, it's not the same, dude. It's not the same. It's not the same. Freddie Prince Jr. Sarah Michelle Geller. Well, not Geller. Sarah Michelle. Uh, what's her face? Buffy. Um. Not the same. Uh, what's his face? I forgot his freaking name from Scream. That plays as Shaggy. What's his name? Oh, Matthew Lillard. There we go. Matthew Lillard. It's not the same. Matthew Lillard will be the... You can't... There's no better Shaggy than Matthew Lillard. Nope. Nope. Hello, Norman. You watched the Flintstones movie this month. <laughs> it was a Geller. Oh, I was right. Okay, Sarah Michelle... Like... Sarah Michelle Geller, it was right, okay. I think I I think I doubted myself because I said Geller and I was like Monica. 
cross. I think Matthew Lillard also did a little bit of voice acting uh, for certain and uh, certain certain um, certain animated shows too for Scooby Doo. I believe. Da -da -da -da. Bam Bam and Pearl were tied to a big machine that gave me the nightmares. Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> Unsettling, I guess, in a way. Especially if you were younger. If you were. Uh, oh. I didn't hit anything. Still haven't hit anything yet. Love to see it. I look away for half a second. He was also in She's All That? Really? I did not know that. He play he played a pretty good killer in Scream. He was psychotic. John Goodman in an orange dress is anybody's nightmare. <laughs> That's funny. I like John Goodman too. I think he's a good actor. Mm -hmm. Oh, you were four when the film came out. I see. Oh yeah, you were terrified then. Absolutely terrified. Have I already tried gas station simulator? Yes, I have. I have a series on it. It's actually really good. Yeah. I played uh, I played some Drago uh, entertainment games. They actually have a new game coming out. I think like next week or next two weeks in 10 days. Exactly. Actually, they, I got an email from them today <laughs> from Drago. I think that's how you say it. Drago or Drago. They want me to play winter survival their new game I'm a little unsure about it I haven't made my decision on it not sure yet Here we go okay let's go to an auction house let's go to a storage unit mm -mm 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 -mm. I don't know why I have the Rocky song in my head. I do have items. I have items in my market, but some of them are broken as well. Hopefully our, I don't know what our repairman does. So how does the repairman work? Do you have to like bring him the item and then click on him or does he do it automatically? How does that all work? Did I see, did I see MJ's message about you getting called out in a game yesterday? Wait, what? <laughs> I beg your pardon. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Have I filled the fuel tank up in this game ever? I think I did it one time. One time. I think it was on the box truck too. We'll go for the cheap one. A nurse or a police officer? Let's go for police, actually. Oh, you're talking about the movie cinema simulator. Yeah, I posted that on Instagram and Discord. Yeah. Oops, I did not mean to do that. There we go. This is a seven thousand dollar. Holy shit. 
we just hit the jackpot. I think we got super lucky. <laughs> Seven thousand dollar gun. Hello. That worked out. That worked out nicely. Up at these big items right now. There we go. Auction time, baby. That pays for multiple units. Pays maybe a trip to the auction house. I don't know. There we go. Okay. One fifty. Okay, this is broken. That's good. Paid for the next nine storages. <clears throat> oh, the purse is full of movies. It is a purse full of movies. What the hell? All right. That rifle could have actually also uh, paid for more uh, shelving too. Uh, not having it. Barely scratched the surface with this thing. Hundred dollar painting. Oh, this is like the best actual unit we've ever had. Another camera. This is six fifty. Holy hell! Too bad we don't have a big truck here. Mm -mm -mm -mm. You buy for three k. You sell for eight k. Depends on item auction. I'm assuming. There's a loss to it, yeah? You can't win. Oh, shoot. You can't win at the auction all the time, right? There's there's a loss element to the auction. Does anybody know that? Hopefully, there's a loss, like a loss element to it. Like, oh, you've overbid kind of thing. What the hell's going on here? There you go. Pay attention to the value of the items needing repairing. Some things are better off in the trash. Like $10 items. Whoops, 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 whoops. Another one. This goes. Okay. That's a pretty good haul right there. To the store. <clears throat> don't upgrade the locker thing it makes the locker prices go up oh you are you talking about the skill tree because if you're talking about the skill tree look sweetheart we've we've done it all already <laughs> we've 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 upgraded it all we're maxed out baby mm-hmm Hauling ass. Ass is hauling. Hello, Spork. How's it going? Come on, Tesla. Come on, Tesla. Hey, subscriber. Hey, Alexa. Hey, Alexa. How many bitches can I fit in a Tesla? <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. I'm joking. I'm joking, Alexa. Stop listening. Stop listening. Stop. Stop listening. Plunta, Plunta, thanks for subscribing. Hello. Mm -hmm. I, you know how I feel. <laughs> oh God, she's. So, I always forget. There's like an AI listening to me. I feel like I Robot. By the way, I Robot, probably one of my favorite movies. I really like iRobot. I enjoy that movie a lot. I do. Hi.
I see you repair you add junk and repair and all that very well she was gonna give me like an actual measurement of how many I can fit in a Tesla there we go cool so that was repaired for free but I can just tell him to do this repair the item for money wait do we pay for that yeah there we go 180 180 there we go hey henzo gas station simulator do you plan to make a new series with all the new dlc that is coming out in the one that has to make a new season um i'm not entirely sure with that some of the dlc that i've i've played on that i wasn't really too impressed um and the game has a very it's not optimized very well and i feel like it, it's I don't know the optimization in that game is kind of rough so I'm not sure maybe maybe not I'm not sure entirely it still says junk parts how many junk parts how many scraps can we use how many scraps can we use yeah whoops Where do I get the scrap? Um, I've randomly gotten scrap from uh, storage bins. Like storage things. Just randomly on the ground. I made you buy that game. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. You're really bad at latte art. Has anybody ever seen my coffee shop simulator? What do they get? No, barista simulator. Oops, sorry, 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 sorry. My barista simulator, that reminds me. I really offended a person in the comment section in that game. And if you want to know how, go watch that <laughs> stream. <laughs> You'll know. You'll know when you see it. You'll know. Look closely. <laughs> I think I offended a mother. I did. I did offend a mother. I didn't mean to. I didn't know her and her kids were watching. I'm sometimes, you know, I, you know, sometimes I forget people watch with their children, but like at the same time, I'm not like a, I'm not fully a, a you know, child friendly. <laughs> channel you know hello it all depends on like what you're willing to let your children hear come out of my mouth I guess I guess that's what it depends I say I'm I would say I'm PG 13 if anything Mm -hmm. This is broken. Item repaired. Nice. So? I don't remember how you could have offended someone. Oh. You'll definitely know. You'll definitely know. Uh, thank you for that, buddy. Let's just say I drew something that was very, uh... Yeah. <laughs> People were getting me, man. Oh, God. Oh, no, 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 no. There we go. RC. There we go. Was it a carrot? And the only reason why I know it was a mom is because she told me, like, she was watching with her ch her children. And, like, it happened and then, like, she was embarrassed. And I was like, I'm sorry, I didn't know. Oh, whoops. Sorry, 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 sorry. Mm -mm -mm. 
Mm -mm. I got a creative drawing in that. <laughs> and I don't know how to draw, man. That's the problem. I don't know how to draw. There we go. I watched the new uh, Grand Tour. I don't know if anybody watches the Grand Tour or anything, but I, they just released a new special. I watched that the other night. That was pretty good fun. It actually kind of puts in perspective a little bit in the new Grand Tour episode. Like, how much of other, like, third world countries, like, how much plastic they use. And I'm like, damn. But, like, plastic using plastic but then like also like not disposing plastic properly it's kind of crazy like there's a like a lot of trash in the world i should say yeah <laughs> part of why i want you is you're not a hundred percent child friendly i want genuine content and it's hard when you already have to censor so much for youtube it's yeah yeah it's it's very true you're very true on that it is quite difficult when you have to censor yourself anyways right for youtube already but I, I i try to i try to do my best i think the hardest part and the most talented thing you could do uh some people kind of like overlook this but it's very 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 at least in my opinion it takes a lot of talent to like entertain people without having the need to like curse all the time you know what i mean that takes a lot of um takes a lot of uh takes a lot of skill and i'm not talking like oh you could just stream and not curse and that's it no that's not it i'm saying like entertain people and not curse entertain you know a large amount of people that's the hard part There we go. YouTube didn't mind the drawing though. That's true. YouTube didn't mind the drawing. YouTube didn't even freaking see it, suckers. But they're like, oh no, Pacific Drive. That's a bad, that's a bad one there, Cans. Can't do that. We're gonna have to demonetize you for inappropriate actions in Pacific Drive. Well, that's not very nice, though, is it? Hey, Dream Alice, how are you? Good to see you. Did I sell the rifle yet? No, not yet. If I would have sold the rifle, my money would be uh, up to the freaking moon right now. There we go. I'm doing the rifle last. I don't need to run around the table to interact with them, but it makes me feel proper. Like, hello, how may I take your order? There we go. Oh, I should probably talk to him. Uh, can we do 90, sir? 90? There you go. Broken. You make up new curse words. How can you make up a new curse word? There we go. It reminds me of that meme that happened like a couple years ago. The Miranda Cosgrove meme. She's like, I do I do curse a little. <laughs> What's your favorite word? <laughs> so funny. If you've ever seen that video. All right. Um, I might actually switch this up. I might put... Um, Let's go. Let's go like that. We go like that. There we go. 60 there and then put the rifle there. That works out. There we go. And then we'll just list this $7,000. Boom, baby. Look at that. There's an item that's... Wait. There are items without an entered price. Oh, this one. This one get knocked around, yeah? 
there another one? This one. 125. There we go. Swearing is so common nowadays. Just seems like every everyday talk now. I mean, <clears throat> I mean, you get swearing on like just basic cable, TV. Not to mention like you know references and stuff like that. <laughs> A lot of hidden references in child's programming. Except for Bluey. Bluey is 100% innocent. <laughs> I was actually memorized by Bluey one time. I was in a hotel room. And I think it, it actually might have been uh, the same trip I had when I actually met Dream Alice in real life. Might have been that trip. I was in a hotel room and I was watching TV. And it so happened to be Bluey on the TV. And I got lost in the sauce with that show because the child or the dog was like running their own like restaurant in the bathtub. And like they were selling burgers out of the bathtub and then they were charging the dad money and like counting change back, I believe. I was like, this is this is entertainment. This, however, is a problem. The bed is gone. Look, the bed is out of here. It's gone. What are you doing to me, game? What are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? I think the house is bugged. I think you might be right. Hello, Tanum. How's it going? Can you open the garage? I think you can open the garage. Yeah, you should be able to because I think you can park your car in there. I think I might have to just live in the trailer forever. Because this isn't working out, man. It's not working out. Hello, Papa Mush. How's it going? might need to turn the game off and on again i mean that's what i have been doing this whole time every time i reload i've been turning it on and off mm -mm -mm -mm. i'll try this again that worked there we go oh you mean turn it on and off again like every freaking time like every time i go to bed hell no Bed, water, mattress is needed. Bed not comfy. Look, we used to have a water bed growing up, and I was terrified of that thing. Why? Because I was afraid it was going to pop. If you jump on a water bed, will it pop? Is it possible for water beds to pop? It is, right? I don't think you can actually sell the house. I think the trailer bed is actually um, permanent. Yeah, I don't think it's I, I don't think it's temp. I think it's permanent. All I was told. Oh, there's a camera on the ground. Did you see that? All I was told as a kid was like, don't jump on the bed because you're going to pop it. Now, I don't know if that was true or not, but that's what we were told. Open up. Okay, go for it. Send it. It's possible for waterbeds to start to spring a leak. I know from personal experiences. <laughs> oh, dude. I feel like if your waterbed leaks or pops or anything like that, I feel like that is like 
that is this like what do you do like that's just disaster like you are like screwed right you're like how do you stop that how do you stop a waterbed i feel like you can't st is it possible to st there's no like safe there's no like fail safe there like it you're screwed right i'm pretty sure you're screwed How are you gonna stop water from like going onto the carpet or whatever it might be right do they still sell water beds though they probably do today's auction day by the way but we don't have enough money for that they have tape and tape a leak okay you can leave A tire repair patch? What? Yeah, let me just... Oh my god, honey, the friggin' uh, bed's leaking. Let me go and uh, get a tire repair patch. What if you don't even know it's leaking? And, like, you go to work, and then, like, you come back, and your bedroom's underwater. What do you do then? You're screwed, right? Send away. Flex seal. <laughs> Flex seal, okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh oh. Come on now. Okay. Hello. Go away. Did anybody ever have those like repair disc things back in the day too? I used to have like for like games and stuff like that or DVDs like you had like that it was like a little thing where it was like it had like a, it was like a spinning thing you like put the disc in the thing you turn on the button and it spins and like fixes your CDs and stuff like that that stuff was sketchy man 60 55 okay your Nana had a water bed you had to fix it with a water bed repair kit there's a waterbed repair kit. <laughs> I think note to self, don't buy a waterbed or who the hell still buys waterbeds. 45. Hello? 70? I need to sell this rifle, dude. You had a waterbed that wasn't one big bubble? That wasn't one big bubble. But there were four or five individual tubes. The tubes prevented a total leak, but I did wake up with a puddle of water once because of one of the tubes leaked. Oh, dude, I would have been I would have been terrified. Oh, I would have not trust that bed ever again. How do you even get rid of it? How do you even get it installed? You know, how do you drain it? There's so many questions. How do you fornicate on it? Like, I, I don't. I don't understand. That must be like actually doing it on a yacht or on a boat, on a sailing boat. Or maybe that's like doing it on like the Titanic door. You know? I don't know what's going on there. No. I'm getting full price, sorry. $35. Hey, Rose, can you scoot over? Yeah, you know, I don't know about that. I don't know. You use a suction hose? Oh my god, what do you use? Siphon your bed? Motion of the ocean. There you go. That's what it is. You take the sheets off and squirt baby oil all over it for the fo oh god how do you know you were like 10 years old you were 10 years old with a waterbed holy hell that's pretty impressive actually i just don't understand like you know the solid foundation of a mattress right solid foundation you have 
a position for your knees to be stabled. You have a position for your legs to be stabled. On a waterbed, you don't have stability. You know what I mean? You have no stability. Was the waterbed like a lot of like 90s, 80s things? If so, that probably like probably makes sense why our parents were like so young when they had us. Cause they probably got they probably drowned, you know? <laughs> Haven't messed with the waterbed since 1985? Because of Nightmare on Elm Street. Wait, was there a Nightmare on Elm Street that had a? Did it had to do with a waterbed? I know. I don't think I've ever seen that movie before. I'm sorry. Sorry, honey. I couldn't get out. I just. I. I was. I, I anchor. I anchored in. They couldn't pull the anchor out. It, it, Bottom of the ocean, you know what I mean? Uh, I don't know what to say. <laughs> there was? Now I gotta look at that. Was it like I gotta I gotta like look up a scene or a clip of Nightmare on Elm Street with waterbeds now. I gotta see this out. I put 7k on the rifle, not 8k. Well, yeah, because it's 7K, not 8K. <laughs> you could use the waves to your advantage, but it was easy. Dude, I tell you, using the waves to your advantage, that rhythm, that's just too... that That's too much skill. I don't have that kind of skill. I don't have... You have to be almost like Spider-Man. You know what I mean? Like you had to be like like this way, that way. Like that's that's too much of the rocket of the boat, man. I can't stay in place and I can't get out. I'm stuck for 18 years now. Here comes the alimony. Ah! Seven thousand dollars. Perfect. There's seven thousand dollars right there, though. That's good stuff. Now I don't know about you, but that's a boat ride. That hey, subscriber. <laughs> that's a boat ride right there. <laughs> Subscriber. <laughs> thank you, Helmut, for subscribing. And thank you, DJ Valak, for subscribing as well. Hello. <laughs> Sometimes the alimony sneak up, sneaks up on you. <laughs> when you least expect it. <laughs> <laughs> ah, funny stuff. My girlfriend literally just asked me why you were screaming because I had my headphones in and I am in tears. <laughs> why are you screaming? You don't want to know. The conversation here is taking a wild turn for, for the least. We're trying to talk about waterbeds and tr trying to figure out the functionality of a waterbed and why waterbeds are a thing. That's what we're trying to do here. I think I can actually pull that off. $80? Yeah, that works. This table. <sighs> of 
We're about to hit $10,000. We're going to hit $10,000. Yeah. Now, technically, we could, if we really wanted to, probably dabble into a little bit of auction, yeah? Maybe. What do you think? How long does the auction last? All day. Does it close at a certain time? There we go. Perfect. 150. <clears throat> <laughs> I told her, I told her I would let her, let her hear later because my son is downstairs and this was a spicy water conversation. <laughs> <laughs> hey, just trying to figure it out, man. It's all. Try to understand. That's it. The auctions at night, so I can go at night. Yeah, I mean it says auction day. You think I can go there like when I hit 10k here in a sec? Well, wait a second. It has to have a closing to it. Yeah, I would assume it has a closing to it. Ah, <sighs> nope. Go away. No half offers. Sorry. You can go to the auction anytime. Okay, very well. Then I'm going to go to the auction when I hit 10k then. I'm going to see about it. Hello, sir. $80? Yes. Okay, we hit 10k. Okay. If I can go there all day, can I just wait till the shop closes? I mean, I only have like three items left though. Yeah, I only have three items. This one's a biggie. 270. Maybe if I can sell that one. We'll do that. I still got a, I got a comment today. Oh, damn it. I meant to bargain him. I got a comment today. Believe it or not. Um, I did get a comment. I was going through my comment section before today's stream. I got a comment today on Supermarket Simulator. They were like, by the way, you threw away bread. And they were dead serious about it. I was like, yes, yes, I did. I did throw away bread. <laughs> I'm still getting comments about the bed, the bread being thrown away. <laughs> At this point, I don't know if people are being serious or if people are just trolling me at this point. I don't even know, man. There we go. Thank you. One more item. We can get 270 here. One more item. <sighs> if you saw that comment. I want to read it. Be like, I did. I did. I. I. I admit. I sold. I. I tossed the bread. I threw away the bread. I did. I did throw away the bread. I did. I did throw away the bread. I. I done did it. That's me. I'm the guy. There we go. Hooray! Ten thousand three hundred eighty-four dollars. Let's go to the auction. Not that way. Not that way. Not that way. Try again. I am kind of curious. What happens if I just went off road? I am curious. Let's see. Probably just hell. It's practically hell. Oh, guardrails too. Yeah, don't go off road. Please don't say you tossed the bread. Is that like, is that like 
tossing the salad. Am I going the wrong way? Does it turn up here? It doesn't turn up here. Oh my gosh. All right. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I might get stuck again. That's true, huh? I should probably be very careful. If I get stuck again, I'm screwed. I should probably not do that. That's a very good idea. Let's go. <sighs> this is definitely not Becky. So going off road is not. This is. This is not Becky. This is like Jerry. Jerry doesn't do very good off road. He doesn't do good with the bumps. There we go. Why are we tossing the salads? I was just saying, is that what tossing the bread means? There we go. Straight ahead. Oh. Is this like a new thing that I don't know about? Is this like a new thing? A new, a new cool thing tossing the bread? Is there like different action? Is that what you do on the waterbed? Toss the bread? <laughs> Honey, I found a new move. It's toss the bread, but we need to buy a waterbed. <laughs> First, buy a water waterbed, then toss the bread. Toss the bread on the waterbed. Ah, perfect. Yeah. There we go. Okay, look at this. Holy hell. Whoa, 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 whoa. We have a police presence here. We are here. Auction area. Yeah, no kidding. Take a screenshot of that because, you know, epic. Hang on, let me, let me, let me take a better screenshot of this. There you go. <clears throat> what is this, the red carpet? The auction will start shortly. Another offer, another offer. Another offer. Another, another offer. New offer. Another offer, another offer. <laughs> Is it two thousand dollars worth? Congratulations to the fund. Okay. The auction will Indian Beauty. And another offer. Three thousand dollars. These things must be pricey. I bid. New offer. I bid. Yeah. Offer. Offer. New offer. I bid. I'm winning. How much money am I bidding? Like, what's the increments here? Is there any other offer? I'm gonna win the Indian Beauty. Congratulations. I've won the Indian Beauty. Next. The auction will Blessings of show. Angels. Is it just paintings that you can buy here? You offer. I mean, they're like dancing, dude. They're 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 clubbing out over here. I just won that for 1500. I won two items. 1500, $6,000, $12,000. Holy hell. Okay. Right. Um, wow. Wow. Okay. Sorry. Did I miss the guardrail? Wow. Right. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. And I'm just going to casually throw it in the back of my truck. No problem. You've only seen paintings and statues so far. 
Okay. <laughs> I just throw it in the back of the like some antique like painting, some original from like 1725. I just yep, toss it. Let's go. Lights on. Here we are. I don't net. I don't need to ever buy a warehouse ever again. I'll just go to the. Well, I guess there's only certain days, huh? You can't go to the auction every day. It's like every four days, huh? Yeah, so you can't do that all the time, but there's that for you. I should have bought the first one too. Or I should have bid on the first one. Yeah. And it's basically the rich person club. That is. So what? Together, that's almost like 20K that we have in the back of the trunk here. What rich person is going to come into my store and buy those? Try the search guy. Is the search guy even worth it right now? And I still have 3,000. Yeah, and I still have 3,000. Don't toss them onto the highway. Yeah, how many paintings make it to the shop? <laughs> <laughs> Mm -hmm. Hello Screech Owl How are you? What's going on? You have a storefront and a car I think I may have missed something There's a good possibility You might have <laughs> Skirt Okay Put these in Hello Swisha How are you? Alright Oh shite Okay This is big This is really big Six thousand. Shite. Six thousand. Twelve thousand. Okay. Okay. Good. Great. Grand. Wonderful. Yes. Now I'm gonna go back home so I can close the game like two or three times because the game is gonna bug out and not go on to the next day. Right. Should I just go straight to the trailer? <laughs> F this. I'm going to the trailer. Let's just do that. I'll go to the trailer. Because then I'll just buy a warehouse in the morning. A storage unit in the morning. And that's close by anyway. So we'll go to the trailer. There we go. You have to price paintings three times. They are worth so you get two times what they are worth when you sell them. That is the rule when it comes to selling painting. Is that the same rule? Does same rules apply when you sell magic cards too? Which reminds me, I did get a box of magic cards in the mail today. In case some of you don't know, I do play magic, yes. Do I come off as the person? Do I look like the person that plays magic? Well, that's very, like, stereotype of you to be, like, stereotypic. Okay, look here, developer. We have a problem. We need this fixed. There's a new a new release of Magic Cards coming out like next week or two weeks from now that I'm super excited about. It's the Fallout ones. Very excited for the Fallout Magic Cards coming out. All right, relaunch it. Mm, 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 mm. 
Do I play commanded or standard? Both. It really depends on who I'm playing with, I guess I I, I would say, or who and where, I, I would say. Uh, 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 uh. Try again. What the hell? <gasps> no! 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 Oh no! It didn't it didn't save the auction, did it? The auction? Uh I got the I got D and D magic cards today. Ah uh, No. Did it save it? I don't think it did, dude. Really? Really? It didn't. So I had to do all of that all over again. Okay. All right. Well, this is what this is what we're going to do. This is what we're going to do. This is what we're going to do. We're going to stop playing for now. Just for now. Just for now. We'll stop the stream here. We'll switch over to uh, Super S Supermarket Simulator. Um, I'll wait for this game to get a patch and an update. Because there needs that needs to be fixed, obviously. Um, so we'll wait for a patch. We'll wait for an update for this game. And I'll come back to this probably sometime next week. Um, that's what we're going to do. We're going to come back to this sometime next week and hopefully by then there will be an update we'll have to see though thank you swisher for the super chat i appreciate you so i'm gonna go ahead i'm gonna take 30 minutes i'll be back here at 45 minutes on this hour and we'll be back with supermarket simulator we'll play that a little bit early okay that's what we're gonna do it's unfortunate it's very unfortunate nothing much i can really do about it but thank you for hanging out with me today I appreciate that. We'll be back here in a sec. I'll redirect you to the other stream. Um, and I'll start at 45 minutes on this hour. Okay? All right. Sounds good? Okay. I'll talk to you soon. Take care. She said we better off as best friends. Ooh, what's the best friend? Can you let me know what it means to be a best friend? Let me know the next man. Here we go better run one time for the best friend. Tell her it's a different